Jumaa Lakeside Radio A group of border border operators has reportedly filed a lawsuit against the Kenya Kwanza government accusing it of excluding them from government plans despite using them during the campaigns uh, So Linda Jami has sued the Kenya Kwanza administration for using the goodwill Omama Mboga and Boda Boda without permission for political gain. And I also want to add the Boda Boda community, the Boda Boda Association as Linda Jami. Let us go and register the copyright of Boda Boda Mama Mboga so that no one can touch it. I know we can go to Kipi and register that goodwill. Kenya Kwanza cannot qualify to be able to register. According to court documents, the Boda Boda riders contend that during the period leading up to the 2022 general election, Kenya Kwanza conducted a campaign primarily focused on empowering and improving the lives of individuals involved in Boda Boda and Mama Mboga businesses. Tuko na mpango ya watu yangu ya boda boda. Kwanzia mwezi wa nane, I will be signing an agreement in the next few weeks ya kupanga mambo ya boda boda. Wanaangaishwa na mabroka na wakora wengine pikipiki ya shilingi ya lifumia moja, mwisho wanalipa karibu 300,000. So, iyo ukora tutamaliza na niko na mpango. So, we are asking the following. The court should declare that Kenya Kwanza administration, their employees and everybody else should not use the term Boda Boda and Mama Mboga without permission until this case is heard and determined. Tulipo chagua serikali ambayo iko mamlakani sasa hivi. Tulikuwa na matumaini makubwa. Tukasema tunatoa mabwenyenye, tukasema tunatoa wale watu ambao walikuwa wanapora inchi, tukasema mambo mengi. Lakini kufikia sasa hivi mambo yameharibika zaidi kuliko vile tulivyo. Sasa tusipoteze muda kwa sababu mwisho wa siku maisha lazima yaendelee mbele. Tuko na ndugu zetu wadogo, tuko na jamii sisi wenyewe, tuko na watoto, maisha lazima yaendelee mbele. Ningeliomba kwamba tukusanye nguvu zetu tuanze kufanya kile ambacho sisi wenyewe tunaweza bila kutegemea serikali. Uh, whatever we are demanding here today is to make sure that whatever is rightful for the citizens goes to the citizens. This is a cry that we have as the citizens of, the, of this country citizens of this uh, uh, nation Kenya we want what is meant for the citizens to go to the citizens wale ambao wameenda koti kuhakikisha kwa masuala haya yanatekelezwa ama yanaangaliwa kwa kiundani basi koti isimame let the judiciary be independent the riders assert that the president william ruto led government has subsequently propagated a narrative claiming that the strictures of the current political administration comprise boda boda and mama mboga individuals which they argue is entirely inaccurate and unfounded it says and i quote that as a result of the impugned utterances by the members of the first respondent political science party the people engaged in boda boda business to earn a living suffer massive financial losses in the future irreparable harm to their goodwill and business signatures reads the court papers the petition filed by malindi boda boda operators linda jami and others also contends that the kenya kwanza slogan has resulted in the boda boda and mama mboga business people losing their income due to the hostility arising from Kenyans dissatisfaction with the current government and i quote additionally the utterances of the members of the first respondent political party that the current executive arm of the government of Kenya is comprised of the boda boda and mama mboga was slash men subject persons engaged in boda boda and mama mboga business to psychological trauma owing to the reduction in their source of income and hostility of the people of Kenya who are clearly dissatisfied with the government's inability to bring down the cost of living the petition father reads the other people who are not in this government feel that it is the boda boda and mama mboga that brought this government to power and therefore they are having some bad reaction towards them they say bad spirit and also they say psychological trauma to the boda boda people and mama mboga people when everybody feels wonder wako kwa serikali lakini hawako ya pili they also feel trauma because Everybody is feeling that ujeuri yao ndio liweka hii serikali iliweka hii serikali kuchukua uongozi. They now so, seek an injunction restraining the government from making statements on Mama Mboga and Boda Boda arguing that such utterances have the potential to violate the petitioner's rights and fundamental freedom. So we are asking the following. The court should declare that Kenya Kwanza administration, their employees and everybody else should not use the term 
Boda Boda and Mama Mboga without permission until this case is heard and determined. In the petition filed by Malindi Boda Boda operators Linda Jami and others, the petitioners are also pursuing compensation of 426 billion shillings. The court should declare that Kenya Kwanzaa administration should, re, should be able to compensate Boda Boda and Mabamboga a total of 426 billion shillings, which is the goodwill which they used to reach into power. Ma, Lakeside Radio. For more and comprehensive updates, press the YouTube subscribe button above and enjoy. Remember to press the bell button for notifications whenever we post. Duond Uganda.